it's, a, it's not an easy technique to work with because what you are doing here, you are playing with something that has to do with water. So as a result, your 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 inks are watercolor inks, your paper is wet. And then if your paper is not wet in a balanced way, there's a possibility of 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 whatever what is there on the on the press but it can just bleed. We have to we have to prepare our plates with gamarabic. Mm -hmm. and, and because gamarabic is made of water soluble and it helps just water to kind of like uh, it helps the whatever what is there on the press beds to kind of like lift up quite easy and um, clear so in this way we can every we can have every detail that you have applied on the press beds without having any problem so what's happening there if i leave this if the artist come and paint then what's going to happen is that uh, whatever what he has applied there as a color, it will print double the amount of the original color. So you will you will notice that area. You yeah. see how the edge, the edge of your of, mm -hmm. of the water what where the water is like being stopped. Yeah. So now as I'm wiping inside there, inside there it will be sort of like clean. Yeah, yes. But you will have your edges mm -hmm. as as darkness as strong as you know, one bright. This is just where we keep our water, our paper, just to soak in, in this bath and preparing for printing and stuff. This is where we soak in paper. Because printing when wet, on wet paper, just helps us to pick up whatever what is on the surface of the plate or on the surface of the press bags. So let's put this one over just to control the paper, water on the paper, even more. It's not the non-protective. No, that's, that's, yeah, that's the non-protective. Oh, okay.